that uh, dress is about a little bit later on in the show. Well, the countdown to Christmas is on, and Santa isn't the only one making a list and checking it twice. If you're still trying to find the perfect gift for all the kids on your list, we can help. We've recruited one of Santa's insiders, toy expert and mother of two, Elizabeth Warner, to share the scoop on this season's most popular toys. Please welcome her this morning. Thank you. Hello there. Thank you so much. All right. You have done the toy expert thing to the point where we understand that Santa actually checks in with you from yeah, time to time. Yeah, exactly. And I have so many great ideas for parents. Yeah. You're the mother of two yourself. I am. They're 15 and 12 now. Getting mm -hmm. big. What we look for in toys is not only the entertainment value, but sometimes we can sneak in a little education and some other things. Yes. So let's see what we have first. Sure. Up. So we'll jump right in with the Leap Pad Ultra. Now, this is fabulous. Kids want tablets with a touch mm -hmm. screen. They actually try and take ours all the time. We want one that's designed for them. Well, LeapFrog leaders in education actually have an in house team of experts, PhDs in child development, early childhood education. They develop all the content for this amazing tablet. Over 800 different things in their library from music to videos to apps that will teach our children while they're having yeah. fun. Yeah, and this is one of those gifts that you might have to give before Christmas if you're going on a long Christmas vacation. Yes, because fabulous that for keeps travel. them busy, yes. Yes. Now, I have to just hand this to you. The original world's softest brand of stuffed animals. Now, these are so squishy, so luscious. You can feel how it light is and fluffy so soft they are. And light. You know what? Let's balance out the toy box. Let's have some things without batteries we can snuggle with and have that wonderful, cuddly best friend that we used to have when we were yeah. all little. And you're so right about being so light. I have a stuffed cow that I, I loved when I was a kid. Named yes. His name is Moo Moo. But anyway, Moo Moo was so heavy and clunky, but this is so light and it's very, very soft. Soft and will definitely become the best friend. Yeah. This one goes everywhere with them. So, all right. a wonderful idea for the holidays. Now, we're going to pick this up. We have a little hidden toy here. This is, yes, brought to us by VTech. Now, we start off as a shopping cart, which is so much fun. Kids love this. Fully interactive, by the way. We turn it on. It's got lights and sound. But then we're going to open it up, and look what happens. Magic. Inside, oh, we've got a full kitchen. They're going to be able to interact with this kitchen. They're going to hear the water. They're going to be directing. They're going to be learning, by the way, colors, numbers, all sorts of things. Okay, but I have a question here. Direction. I have a question here. How come when they're 16 and you send them to the grocery store, they don't want to go? <laughs> <laughs> but when they're exactly. three, they're all like, look, Mama, I got I, grocery exactly. shopping. I'm doing all kinds. Of, yeah, they don't want to do that, and then they don't want to see anything called a, a kitchen no. when they get older. Of course they don't, but while they're little, we can dream. Yeah. As yeah. parents, we can keep dreaming. Yes. Oh. Yeah, so, and you know what? Someone in the audience might be going home with one of those oh. today. Magic Fundo. This is something that I love. It's creative. All their sets, by the way, so fun and interactive. Under twenty dollars. No bling. No batteries. This is old-fashioned classic play. Yeah. We're gonna mold. We're gonna have fun with the dough. Now, another thing we can do with this dough, which I love, is there's something called transfers. We're gonna take this. Actually, we'll okay. put the dough down onto right. the platform. Flip that little girl with her cowgirl hat upside Over down. Like put her down okay. on the dough. Then we open this up and just apply water, just like we would a temporary tattoo on our own. Skin. Okay. After it takes about a minute, after about a minute with that on there, that tattoo will be actually on the dough. They can create their own little characters and have a lot of fun. Yeah, and, and sparking the imagination is one of those things that's just so important. Yeah, we kind of so lost some of that. A lot of great creativity. So in about a minute, that okay. will have a temporary tattoo on All it. Right. Now, Little Pim, an award-winning, amazing program which teaches our little ones language. Ages zero to six is when they absorb foreign language the best. So this has actually 11 different languages. Languages. There's so many things from flashcards to books. I absolutely love this discovery set. It comes with three DVDs. Of course, our star of the show. Uh, this little guy is in all the DVDs. Each DVD, by the way, 60 words they're going to learn and all themed so that young children are actually going to love it and have a great time with it. Yeah, yeah, this is so cool. I think I want this for myself, though. And you know what? I, I have to tell you, it is a fabulous yeah. thing. You 60 words per DVD. We're going to come out of there learning an awful lot I about a bunch it. of different languages. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Soy Deborah Duncan. Bienvenidos. Yeah. Yeah. It, works. It. it works. Beautiful. <laughs> Somebody had little Pim when she was little. <laughs> so now we're going to go ahead. I'm going to actually... Uh, if you could hold this for me that. just for a yeah. second. I'm going to turn this iPad on. Now, right now, the wave of the future is some really cool interactivity with our smart device. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and actually hold this up for you. This is a Pop-Art 3D interactive 
piece of art. Now, what we'll see here is, yes, okay. okay, there's our guy. This is actually projecting from the poster. What we're going to be able to do with this is we're going to be able to learn all about the human body. This is human anatomy from Popar. They also have, look at that, now we see that skeleton. Depending how we move, we're going to be able to turn them around. We can actually go through and learn all about, hey, how about the digestive this system? This is really cool. Look at that. That is all off of that poster. We can also learn, by the way, about the solar system, the periodic chart. You can see here I'm reversing this and turning it around so we can see the systems from all different angles. But what I love about it is we can choose. Do we want to see the whole body? Do we want to focus in on a particular part? You can send your three-year-old to medical school. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they get started right away. So here I've just focused in on the torso. So the educational value is amazing. And this is a way, put this up on your wall. Yeah. It comes just as a poster, like you could imagine in the store. Anywhere from $10.99 to $19.99, cool depending on where you shop. We all learn about this in science, but yes. it's not as fun. If you make it fun, Fun kids will want That's to learn. Right. Let me just get a, a little check for these kids in the audience this morning. How many of you would love to learn science and learn about the body this way when it's done like this? Right? Yeah. 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 You're like, okay. Absolutely. So very exciting. So we have a little bit of fun to go home. We have some magic fun dough for the audience. Yeah. And we have the VTech two in one shop and cook kitchen. Well, thank you very much. We'll take this off right here, and oh, there is. is our little ah. tattoo. <laughs> On the cute. fun dough. <laughs> love it, love it, love it. Thank you so much. Thank and you. for more on Elizabeth's top holiday toys, just log on to GreatDayHouston.com. <laughs> well, today on Facebook, we want to know what was your favorite childhood toy? Maybe it's your first teddy bear, Legos, the Rubik's Cube. I love my pogo stick and my velvet doll where you pulled the hair out of the top of her head. Log <laughs> on and let us know your favorite toy from yesteryear. We'll share some of your comments later in the show. What was your favorite toy? Oh, you know what? I had a big love for Etch a Sketch. Oh, yeah, 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 love yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sketch. yeah, even that's like a new generation now. Yes. Okay, well, you might need your own sleigh to haul all those toys in. We'll take you behind the wheel and show you a gift the whole family can enjoy Woo! coming up next. Yeah.